This is a quick demonstration of how to import points into the spatial portal uh, with the emphasis on faceting on those points and the key issue is they don't have to be related to species. It could be any information associated with the point location. In this case, it's a list of all the proposed and implemented wind farms across Australia. So we have the name, longitude, latitude, how many megawatts it puts out, um, or proposed to put out, and its status and state. So in this case we have the three core pieces of information, one continuous variable on the megawatts and two categorical variables or what we would call contextuals uh, in the status and state or territory. So to import those, it's quite simple. Import points, enter a name, wind farms seems appropriate. Go to that file, CSV format, comma separated in other words, and it displays in pale blue, which is not terribly helpful. But we're going to facet on various characteristics anyway, so it doesn't matter. So at the moment it's just a user-defined color, which of course we can change wherever we like, but let's facet on how many megawatts a wind farm puts out or is proposed to put out. It recognizes the continuous variable and breaks up the categories as such. We could actually create a subset on this by clicking on those we wanted to create a new layer, but in this case I'll just move on and demonstrate the facet on the uh, categorical variables. And in this case it's sorted by increasing, uh, sorry, by decreasing uh, status occurrence. In other words, most are feasibil in feasibility phase or operating both at 26. And again, you could create a subset layer by selecting various ones that you're interested in and create a layer. Anyway, it's as simple as that.